Well, the Come On weekend starts very early. Volunteers start arriving uh, the day before to set up and are here on site uh, before 4 a.m. Uh, preparing to meet the first patients as they come through the door at about 5 a.m. We're making a little dent in a big problem that we have in our state and in this country, and that is we have so many people that just cannot afford services anymore. There's, you know, the economy, especially now, is, is bad enough, and it's been bad enough for a while. A lot of lost jobs that we've just got to try to make a difference in any way we can. ¿Cuántos años tienen no, no dientes? How many years have you had been without teeth? ¿Cuántos? Como dos años. Two years he's been without uh, his teeth. Uh, can you look here? You can look uh, at his mouth and see where the teeth were missing. Dr. Hartman is showing you. And now he has a new upper plate, a partial plate. Doesn't that look better? He was in line since seven o'clock last night for service today. Mira in el in a espejo, por favor. Oh, she got one. Que bonita. Oh, ya se quebró. It's part of swear thing. <laughs> Every person that was working here that I have made eye contact with or that I've talked to has been so pleasant, so, so cordial, really, really great people. I uh, came here last year at Loveland and um, I had 11 extractions and throughout the year I finished through with all my work, got my parcels and got a pretty smile again because of it. We can't, in a nation this rich, have this many people in need of just dental care. So I imagine a lot of these people don't have health insurance either, you know. I mean, these are people without health insurance, without dental insurance. And it just shows how much compassion there is in the world, there is in dentistry, and uh, I hope that uh, particularly uh, the legislatures take a look at this and see that uh, dentists and people involved in dentistry are really care about people.